Welcome to the shop menu demo. In this demo, we will be navigating through the shop menu option. Through the shop menu option, you're able to access the shopping submenu. Through that submenu, you're able to access your shopping homepage, the advanced product search, view your favorites, view forms, add non-catalog items, and browse catalog suppliers, categories, and contracts. Another submenu option under the shop menu is my carts and orders. Through that submenu option, you're able to open up your active shopping cart, view draft shopping carts, which also includes all carts assigned to you or that you've assigned, and view orders you submitted within the last 90 days. So let's get started. So when you log into Bearby, the system will automatically take you to the Home Shop page. Through this page, you could access the hosted catalog vendors, the frequently used forms, and the punch out vendors. To access the Shop menu option, just move your cursor to the shopping cart icon. All you need to do is hover over it or click on it, depending on what you want to do. So the shop menu contains two submenus, shopping and my carts and orders. Within shopping, you'll be able to access the dashboard, the go to section, and the browse by section. The dashboard contains a shopping home link. This link just takes you back to the home shop page. Within the go to, you're able to access five different actions. The first being advanced search. So if you click on advanced search, the system opens up the advanced product search. So here, you can just type in the product that you want to search. For instance, I'm gonna type in glossy paper. And see what the system brings up. After I typed in glossy paper, the system brings up all the results that contain the term glossy paper. You're then able to shop from this search result, create additional filters to refine your search result, and then add items to your cart. Another go-to item is view favorites. Let's click on that now. You could access every item that you've selected as your favorite by selecting this View Favorites link. When you select this link, the system brings up all the items you've identified as your favorites. Another item that you could access through this shopping submenu is Forms. So let's click on View Forms. By selecting View Forms, we're able to see all the forms that are available to be used in Bearby, not just the frequently used forms. Another go-to item is a non-catalog item link. So say you just want to add one non-catalog item, you click on this link, and the system opens this non-catalog item little form. Many of you have used this when shopping, so you can continue to use it as you do today. Another category within the shopping submenu is browse by. You can browse products by supplier, categories, or contract. So let's click on browse by supplier. When we select supplier from the browse by section, the system pulls up all the suppliers that are open for ordering. You can jump straight into a supplier's profile by selecting the supplier name 
or add a quick non-catalog item by selecting this non-catalog icon. So now let's look at My Carts and Orders. Items listed under My Carts and Orders submenu are viewing active carts, viewing draft carts, and viewing orders submitted within the last 90 days. So when you select Open My Active Shopping Carts, the system takes you to your current active cart. Your active cart contains items that you've added to your cart but have not processed for ordering yet. If you're ready to process your order, you could either assign the cart if that's what you choose to do or view cart details to access the submit button. Remember, a quick shortcut to viewing your active cart is hovering over the banner, selecting the cart cart and then either selecting view my cart or checkout. View my cart takes you directly to your active cart and checkout takes you directly to where that submit or assign button live so it jumps into the view cart details. Another item listed under my carts and orders is view draft shopping cart. So through this link, you're able to access all the draft shopping carts that you have. Currently, we only have one cart, that is our active cart. Say we had multiple carts, this is where that information will live. Another item that might live under here is if someone's assigned a cart to you. If someone's assigned a cart, that cart will live within your draft cart. So to access any assigned carts, you'll have to navigate to this View Draft Shopping Carts link. Currently, I have no carts assigned to me. The last item within the My Carts and Orders submenu is View My Orders Last 90 Days. So let's click on that right now. That link brings up all the requisitions, all the carts that we've submitted within the last 90 days. Here we see a list of 16 items. If you want to refine this search a little bit more, you could look at the filters on the left hand side. If you want to see orders that are older than 90 days, you can change the date range by expanding the date range section. There, you could expand it to see anything within the last 120 days, the last month, previous year, or enter a custom date range. This concludes our shop menu demo. So to recap, the shop menu item contains two submenus, the first being shopping. Through the shopping submenu, you could access the shopping homepage, access the advanced product search option, view your favorites, view forms, add non-catalog items to your cart, and browse catalog suppliers categories and contracts. The other submenu option within the shop menu is my carts and orders. Through this submenu you're able to open up your active shopping cart, view your draft shopping carts, which also includes any assigned carts, and view orders within the last 90 days. If you have any questions regarding the shop menu option or any other additional options within Bearby, please submit your questions to the Bearby help desk. On your screen you see their phone number, hours of operation, and email address. Thanks for watching.